on, baby, come on! Yeah! Yeah! Stupid horse! I'll chop your head off! How is it going, viewers? Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment, returning to Vice City. And this mission takes you to Diaz's mansion, which will eventually become Tommy's mansion. But that is for a future mission. This one is called The Chase, and you have to chase down some guy and find out where some drugs are being uh, stashed for Diaz. And it can be a pain in the ass because, well, as you chase the guys down, they shoot at you. And the reality is you can shoot back, but ultimately you should just follow them and not get close to where they shoot at you. I didn't do that. And, well, I got shot up a few times, but eventually I did succeed in the mission. So let's begin with this mission called The Chase. Come on, baby, come on! Yeah! Yeah! Stupid horse! I'll chop your head off! Arrgh. Who is this thickhead? Tommy Versetti. You remember me. Excuse me. I'm a little anxious. Never trust a goddamn horse. You do a good job. You work for me now. I work for money. As I said, amigo, you work for me now. I work Shut for up. Money. Some Judas has betrayed me. He thinks I don't know how much money I should be making. But stealing 3% is as good as stealing 100%. No one does this to me. No one. You follow him from his apartment, and you see where he goes. Later, we will kill him. This asshole thinks he can mess with me? If this is the best Vice City has to offer, this is going to be easy. Okay, this mansion has a Lamborghini-type car. I just didn't see what it was called, but it doesn't matter. You drive this car to the guy's apartment, and that's all you need this car for is to drive to his to his apartment. I just ran over a hooker, and look at all the money. Now I gotta walk upstairs and take a look at the guy's apartment. Now Tommy has to give chase. Just, <clears throat> sorry about that, follow the guy and run across the roof. You can't get ahead of him. You can't stop him. You just got to run. And then he shoots at some exploding barrels. And you just kind of work your way through and try and not get burned. And he runs away and escapes. And again, you really should just follow the guy and not try and shoot him or stop him because the whole point is you have to grab the wheels and follow him to find out where his gang is stashing the drugs. You really shouldn't be shooting at him or anything like that because the reality is you want to follow him where he is going to stash the drugs or where he stashed the drugs. And he shoots up your mini bike, and I got to grab a taxi cab. I slowed him down, but now he's still going to shoot at me. And the reality is just. Hang back 
and follow at a distance to where they won't shoot at you. What a waste of a good cab. Now I gotta get another car and follow the guy because he can get away. And actually, if you kill the guy and blow up his vehicle, you fail the mission. The whole point of this mission is to follow him to where the drugs are stashed. Or should I say, the medical stuff is stashed. Yeah, car's getting chopped up pretty quick here. So again, my advice is follow the guys until they get to their destination, which is actually right here, where I am now turning around, and now you can kill the guys. There you go. You discovered the location where they are stashing the drugs and you got $1,000. That's all you have to do. Now you can return back to your hotel, save, or armor up, whatever you want to do. Again, this mission is just follow the guys to this location. Then you can kill them right here, Prawn Island. Now, once you are done, Again, you can armor up or do what you need to do, but this mission is complete. I am Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment. If you like this mission or this video, hit the thumbs up icon. Feel free to leave a comment. I produce four videos a week involving video games, and if you don't want to miss out, hit the subscribe button and then the bell icon and you will be notified when I post more videos. They can be anything from Vice City to Valhalla to uh, whatever, but I digress. Again, I'm Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing, and thanks for stopping by.